Yo, what's good, YouTube? Mini here, bringing you guys on next episode of the Dark Souls 3 Let's Play. And last time we played, we defeated the Dancer of the Valley. And now we are going to be able to activate by placing the basin. And unlock the way to Lawfish Castle. Gotta move the knight. And I guess blood is just sitting in it. <laughs> and we filled the basin, which will unlock the way. And with that statue moved, it will make this ladder fall down. I really love that. I don't know why. The scene this is just so cool. Like the everything moving and the heaviness falling down, the ladder clanking. It was real cool. Alright. Uh between episodes I did level up. I did put on lightning spear if we want one. We do we are set to uh I did switch out a ring uh to this one with rolled boost roll invisibility at the cost of defense. I'd rather be able to I dodge more than try to take a hit. Um, the only thing left that we have to level up is our faith. And that's what we're going to focus on. So, we are going to go this way first. If I remember correctly, this is going to lead us here to this knight. We got more of these cathedral knights that are here as well. Just a little bit stronger now. But we're going to get this backstab. We did fish for it a little bit. And we just take him out. We get a large shard from him. I forget where this goes. And why we want... Oh, this goes to... Oh, I do remember where this goes. We're going to the side path first. Uh... Oh, wait, I think that's the one that we wanted to roll off on. Yes, it is. So, down here is a lot of those guys, those hollows that we have seen transformed before. Um, some more of those knights, but this is the king's garden. We get a shard. That's the most important thing right off the back. And now, from here, there's... This is gonna be a lot of dodging in this pay in this in this roll uh, in this way, because I'm not gonna. Oh, we got a nice chunk. We got some more of these guys, uh, quite a bit of them actually, and we can get toxic with these. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh, God. I can't get him to stagger. That's the big thing. And with the ring, we do take more damage, but we get more invisibility rolls. Oh, which we are dead. So. I'm going to just try to kill this first one. And see if it drops anything. But there's a million of those. So we probably aren't going to be fighting too many of them. But. Not great, so to start off. With the ring that gives us more damage, but hopefully we can roll to dodge better. That's what, I, what we're going to use for now. We might switch it back later.
Knock that guy around. Nice and easy. Wait for the buff. They will drop shards every time now. We're going to do the same thing. And drop down. Oh, way too high first. Oh my god, look at that damage. Do we take more damage from fall damage too with this ring? I'm wondering. Oh my god. Alright, we're gonna make our way up here first. Oh, this guy can get up here? I thought he couldn't. Okay. One moment, guys. We'll figure this out in one second. We want to come grab all this items. We got the claws and the uh, shadow gear. There's a guy over here for some reason. So it's just a uh, high maintenance area that you have to be particular in. We're going to grab this item. And we're going to go in here next. So now we'll head. This will take us up into another side path. So this is not the main uh, way to proceed. Oh, uh, maybe I shouldn't have done this way yet. Dragon scale ring. And we have this guy up here that will would be shooting spells at us. Oh, is there a way to get down without dying? Uh, first inventory do we have? We have one. And then I'm going to pop one of these. That might have been dumb. We might have just wasted it, but that's okay. Okay, this takes us back here, which we'll... Oh, missed an item. Well, another chunk. That's very important. We'll go back this way, and we'll call down this lift and go all the way up this time. So, yeah, this is all uh, optional going this way but it's actually very good things over this way so we do want to go fully through it and if you're not worried about all this optional stuff just grab the extra shard and then you don't have to come this way all right i think this is a shortcut of some kind Oh, yes, it is. We got more thralls here. Oh, you know what I'm wondering? If our weapon is very much not res is resistant by those things. Because it is dark. So, we're going to take out these guys. I'm not sure what that buff spell was. Got another chunk. Yeah, this should be... Pretty much, yep, a shortcut. So we'll go back and rest at the castle. Oh, not the castle. At the bonfire real quick. And we can then head back up. And continue. 
so every NPC's quest line is done. I think we, I do, I remember there's two spots that Grey Rat could be. And I think we failed because we didn't have the Onion Knight in the place yet. So Grey Rat should be dead in the valley. We can go find his body and get his ashes. Um, but there is actually one NPC that is still up and moving. And it was the uh, guy that the what what looked like he was part of the Legion. Uh, I forget his name. Hawk something. Was it Hawkeye or Hawk? Hawk. There's something with Hawk in it, I believe. And then with that, um. Let's also look at the dragon scale ring. Did that? I don't remember what that is. Reduce damage from backstabs. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's good for a t PvP, I guess. But we don't get backstab much in PvE. Uh, e. We'll take this guy out, who would buff these knights in here. And there's two of them. We're going to try to get one of them to come this way now. But right now, let's poke them for some damage. Come on, can you stop? Okay. Oh. Okay. Took one hit. Didn't need to do the double roll that we did. And then we got this knight here. Oh. Oh. Oh, nice dodge. Oh, come on. I thought he was dead. A magic stone plate ring will boost all resistance to magic, which is pretty nice, especially with the boss that is coming up here. And you can hear crying. And we'll attempt the boss now. He looks very familiar to a scaleless dragon from before. All right. And this is, is this Ocelot the, this is, I think his name is also Ocelot, which is, actually it's the Consume King. And it was also started with an O, that's what it was. Oh. Okay. Got two flasks left. All right, now come the spells. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Maybe this ring is not the 
best option. Because I don't I don't think it's boosting too much of all the time. But that is the consume king. Um which I don't remember the law fully of him. I might have to read it up on it again. Um but uh the idea is I think he's is similar to um Seif the Scaleless. Or he related somewhere somehow there. So Alright. We'll head back through the shortcut. Take out this one. Take out this one. Or we'll miss this one. And we'll take it. I'm out after the getting hit a little bit. And we can use this life hunt scythe. To heal on this next enemy. Gotta call it back up. And then we'll run past those two knights. And hop into the boss room. I really enjoy Lothfish Castle when we get into it. The design of it is really nice. And there's a lot of fun area of funness to it. Got full health from it. Pretty nice. And now we'll roll by these guys. And into the fight. You can hear him crying still in the back. Okay. Let's try this again. Um, I don't know how much is... Let him take out that pillar. Oh, wow. We just barely missed that tail. I, okay. I think there's a baby crying in the background, too. Which I think is who he's talking to. Alright. Now, maybe it's not magic. Just ice attack. I'm not doing too much damage to him. Yeah, there is a baby. And I'm pretty sure that's Ocelot. Oh. Now we're going more fail. Which, now this is phase two. Oh, I was not expecting that. I thought it was a... Damn. I thought that was going to be a slower, not, uh, not as quick lunge. So, note to self. Yeah, I'm not doing too much damage to him, but I also might just be my weapon. For this fight. Because it might not be the guess against him. Uh, hexes and dark magic or dark imbues. So I'm wondering if switching to this might be just for this fight. He doesn't use this. Let's see what this does to him. Alright, I'll see you guys when I get back over there. Okay. We are back. This knight is still chasing us. Well, we'll see what we can do with this time. Oh, that's only does 122 a swing. Oh, come on.
Oh, come on. Yeah, that's only doing 122. This is still better. Oh, that was dumb. Oh, I was... Okay, we are not doing too hot right now. Okay, you can get two hits in before... Oh, I thought he was transforming. Okay, he's transforming now. Oh. Oh, wow, that did a lot of damage. Okay, let's try this again. I also went and upgraded my weapon one more level because I had enough stuff. Okay, you can get two swings in when you're close. Oh, I was out of stamina. I'm going to take the heal. There's the ice. Nice dodging there. Oh, I was, yep. Uh oh, I'm stuck in it. Oh, that was a big hit. Oh. Gotta stay close. He's gonna... I'll take him swinging into the wall like that. Watch out for the tail. Oh, here come the tail again. I was out of stamina. Oh, yep, that is a big hit. One more hit. All right, one more hit now. Got him. Woo! Yeah, you have to stay close to him. Let him get, the, let him get distance because then he'll do that one attack. And now, what's behind the door that he is guarding? Uh, what it figures. Oh, one is alive. We see what he looks like. Oh, we don't. But looks very similar to some other enemies we've seen be or in the past. Some snake-like enemies. And we get from here Path of the Dragon, which we need to for something later. And we get a chest. Titanite Shard or Scale. Ah, well, that's everything over here, guys. Oh, god dang it. I was trying to be cool. Oh, this is not. You actually have to hit it? I thought you could back stuff through it. Well, actually, there's an illusion on my wall. Untended grove or graves. 
And we get an achievement for finding this hidden location. And shouldn't we still, and I think that is gonna be, um, uh, do I want to keep going or not? I think that's what we're gonna call today's episode, guys. And we'll do the un, uh, groves, untended groves next episode. So thank you guys for tuning in. Leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe if you haven't. Peace.